Hello everybody and welcome back to my Enter the Gungeon series in which we try to mod the Gungeon. In today's episode we're going to be playing around with the Cormorant set which is all the Good Knight pieces. If you get them all it gives you an insane buff which is zero reload. It's it's just mega, it's so good. So we're going to be messing around with that today. It's something that you're never going to get naturally in the game. So let's just get right into it. I have tried this four times now and it has crashed every single time when I spawn in the set. So let's hope that this time it works. I can't use the tab autofill, it just crashes the game. So let's try and see if it works. Helmet, give, gun knight, underscore, are more. Give, so, gun knight. So sorry, it's going to take me a bit of focus here to get this right. Good night, Greaves. Give gun night underscore. Is that how you spell it? One second. It's yes, they're good. And give underscore. No, give good night underscore. What's the last one? Um, I can't remember what the last one is. Can everyone remember what the last one is? Good night gauntlet. Let's check if that's right. I believe it is. So we're now the cormorant. I'm going to give myself two more things to make it a bit more interesting. Give platinum the bullets and give the let's go oh shit give the underscore secret at Belair there we go. And that's it. I'm not going to mod anything else in. I'm not even going to touch the menus anymore. Because it's ridiculous. I tried it. It just keeps crashing the game. I would like to give myself Ancient Heroes Bandana. But I think it's just going to crash the game if I do. I'm just going to have to give myself ammo drops, I think. Yeah, we're just going to have to have a fairly normal run, unfortunately. Uh, because apparently, yeah, giving ourselves one more item just screws the pooch. And it's a sad day when that happens. But as you can see, this is already pretty insane. Um, but I gave myself platinum bullets for all the guns that don't have one ammo in the magazine. We want to be able to expend that clip as quickly as possible. And the best way to do that is to f increase your fire rate like a motherfucker. Increase it ridiculously so. So we do have platinum, uh, not platinum bullets, sorry. Um, bloody 9 mil there. Uh, so I'm going to try and give myself the casings. Give casings... 100. That did work. Cool. I'm just going to get that. That's going to be pretty good. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I really would like to give myself Ancient Heroes Bandana here, but I'm just so scared that it's going to crash again. Right. There we go. Cool. We got that open, which is very nice. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Right. Let's try and get down here. Want to be going through as many floors as possible, getting all our chests unlocked. So, yeah, unfortunately, for in, in terms of ammo, it's going to be a fairly normal run. I will, I might try and give myself Ancient Heroes Bandana later, but if I just can't risk the game crashing again. It's going to be so sad if it does. Oh, this is so powerful, though. Even just, just the Scrambler makes this insane. I love it. Bloody 9 mil is just the best. So, obviously, the uh, the Scrambler's not going to really be... I wouldn't say it's going to be the Cornerstone. Um, by the way, do, the, the Cormorant City just give, does give you three care, so we'll be seeing some cast enemies. Um, I wouldn't say it's going to be the Cornerstone, the Scrambler, but just simply because of its ammo count. But it is going to be very, very useful for bosses. L let's let's say that. I'm just using it now to sort of demonstrate its power. Um, but it is going to be very, very useful for bosses, yeah. We're going to be able to just, just destroy. Absolutely destroy. Whoopsie. How about you calm down, fella? There I go. Yeah, it's just so powerful. All those scramble amblers. And then the bloody 9 mils every now and again. And as well, bloody 9 mil triggers more often on weapons that have lower ammo um, per magazine. And obviously this only has one, so it's going to be triggering a fair amount. But yeah, hopefully I can just do that every now and again. And just give ourselves um, ourself money to uh, buy things that are awesome. 
I, I've said, I said before in my other modded runs, I am going to just cheat in my modded runs because it's all about the, the fun. It's all about the fun factor. If we can buy an item that's going to make it more fun, but we have to cheat to get it, I'm going to cheat to get it. Simple as. It's just more fun. It's more fun for everyone. There we go. Look at that 9 mil. Look at it go. Oh, yes. Ooh. The Zorgon's pretty cool. Um, let's just see how this works. Okay, this, yeah, this doesn't really work very well because you have to fire an extra time to fire the final shot. Shame, really. Yeah, that doesn't, that doesn't work the best. <clears throat> we do have a key in our shop as well that we can buy, so we'll probably go and buy that at some point. At some poignant point. But for now, let's uh, head on into this room and wreck these bosses up. Oh, we'll get so many bloody nine mils going. It's, it's just insane. This, the scrambler's got to be the best item for this, like out of all the items. Yeah, I'm gonna have to blank that just in case. It just uh, you use up a lot of ammo with it, but my god, look how insane that was. There's nothing they can do. Our oh, gold casing as well. How generous. Unity is gonna be pretty cool. There we go. Don't have to worry about you. Right, cool. So we want to be like buying guns that we come across things like that. Um, for now, let's just buy our key and go down to the oubliette. We'll um, we'll destroy this because we've already had a gun. Mm, do you know what? Give key five. Cool. Let's open it. I'm very glad we did that. Very glad indeed. That 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 takes away all of our ammo worries, and we'll be getting four ammo per floor as well. So it's very reasonable for us to purposely get hit. So let's go down to our next floor. Uh, actually, before we do, let's quickly search for our secret room. I don't want to spend too long faffing around. It's not going to be there. there are too many things on the either of the walls. It could be here. Yeah, it is here. Cool. And the phoenix is something. Oh, we got the synergy as well. That's with the holy grail, I believe. Um, oh, no, it'll be with the scrambler. What? Because it's egg-based. But it's, it's useful, but honestly, it's got too high of, an, uh, of a mag capacity to be great. So for now, we're just going to be using the scrambler. Uh, but yeah, I completely forgot the holy grail is something we could give ourselves to really increase our like ammo count. Uh, so now we're going to be able to use the scrambler for the majority of rooms, which is very nice. I do want to use other guns too, but we just haven't got any that work well yet with the, uh, with the cormorant. And I don't want to be just using guns for the sake of it. I want to be using guns that are good with a cormorant. Like... And this is this is the prime the prime real estate of good with cormorant. So once we're out of ammo, we just get hit on purpose like this. There we go. Because we're going to have enough armor. Like by far, going to have enough armor. I'm just going to cover the room. Let let the let the little eggs do their jobs. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> Lovely. Lovely jubbly. Yeah. Now we should have enough keys to like withstand ourselves for the entire floor. It seems to be like giving yourself over a certain amount of items can just crash the game. So I need to be really careful with that. Because we've had we've had a crash on the last episode as well when I was trying to spawn in ghost bullets. That was with the tab auto fill though that you guys suggested. It's a great suggestion. I, I, I was really uh, really glad you guys recommended it because I didn't know about it. But it's just not usable. It just crashes the game instantly no matter what I spawn in. So unfortunately I can't I can't exactly use that. Poopilon are you dead? You are dead. Oh my god. Oh. Difficult times. Okay, I got a shop down there. Cool. Hello, bullets. Please stop. Do you know what? Don't give a damn. Got, arm uh, got ammo from it, so. Don't give a diggity damn. That's useless for us. Um, let's keep on keeping on. Yeah, unit is going to be really good for us, actually. 4% uh, damage increase off of the weapons damage so it's four percent of that weapons damage added to um to the whole gun that you're holding so say we have the stinger in our back pocket or the rc rocket's better example because that does 100 damage we would then get four damage added to the scrambler which four damage is really respectable that's a lot like there's some guns that only do four damage per shot there's some guns that do less so think of it that way oh another key now we've got eight holy shit synergy chest Ooh, portable turret. Um, is this with Unity, maybe? Gain, it gains the power of um, all of your other weapons. Okay, that's pretty interesting. I like that. Oh my god. Get them bloody nine mils going. Ow. 
Back to full ammo though, so. Who's really winning? I think it'd be me. But yeah, this is just, like, it's such a fun, um, like, synergy, but it's so powerful that I can understand why it's so rare. Although, in my opinion, it might be a bit too rare, because the only time that I've ever seen anyone get it is on clone runs. Like, and even if you manage to get it on a normal run, the earliest you're going to get it is, like, fifth floor. If you get it before fifth floor, you're a madman. Because getting good night peace does increase your chance of getting further good night pieces, but not by enough, in my opinion. It should be a bit more increased. Like, it shouldn't be quite like the payday synergy. Payday synergy, you're just guaranteed to become the clown guy, uh, Dallas. You're guaranteed to become him after, um, after, like, two floors. You always get all the payday items, which is good. I do like that. The payday items are, are very, very nice. Apart from the loot bag. Loot bag is the devil. Ow. Oh, well. Boot bag is the devil, and everyone knows it. Oh, I love them bloody animals. <coughs> Fill the room. Fill the room. Fill the room. Hehehe, yeah, boy. Get that start up for you. Thank you. And chest. Mega hand again. Not a great weapon to do with this because it just has such a high ammo capacity, anyways. The scrambler's still gonna be like my main weapon. We'll come across something eventually. I was hoping for something like the RPG. That'd be really good. But the more weapons, the merrier anyways, because we get damage bonuses from them all, so... It's all good, really. All good, really. Ugh, I hate the bullets. They just hover. Oh, -ho, I'm so glad I got bloody, bloody 9 mil. It's such a fun item. Don't even get a chance to shoot. How do you feel about that, fella? By the way, I'm just saving my portable turret for the boss. It's not going to be very useful in these rooms when, we, when we're killing things this fast already, so... Kind of thought it makes sense. Calm down, little, little guys. Calm down. Hoi! 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 These guys are spawning in. Can't believe one shot takes these guys out. One shot. One shot does plenty. Yeah, just fire a bunch up into the middle there. See how that goes. Ah! Yeah, now you guys are all dead. Now you see that one bullet just chasing him. It's like, no, I gonna catch you, gonna catch you. Right. Got our boss here. We've been to both our chests, so we don't really need to search the rest of the floor. There'll probably be a gun muncher. I'll check it anyways, you know what? Just just for just for all time's sake. I don't know what that means, but you know what I mean. I mean, yeah, I, I guess. That's great. Extra ammo. Becky has joined the crew. I will pick this up now, because I don't know if I have time to go down to that floor. Like, I am on a bit of a limited time run here, so I can't guarantee I'm going to be able to go to that floor. But I can at least attempt it. Portable turret, please. There we go. It got demolished. Sorry, portable turret. Oh, fuck. Oh shit, I got hit. Oh well, it doesn't really matter if I get hit because I do just get more ammo, so. It's fine. Alright, this guy's so nearly dead. I'm just stand in this bottom corner. But yeah, um, the the uh, the turkey's gonna really increase our ammo capacity, which is very, very nice. Every um every third shot we hit regains ammo, so. Pretty nice indeed. There it goes, dead now. Like, again, we don't need to flawless that guy because he doesn't give you a mass round anyway, so. The ammo bell is, is alright, actually. Kind of, it kind of synergizes with um, Holy Grail in a way. Uh, so now we're just going to head down to the next floor. Going to give us another four armor just for going down to this next floor. So it's going to be pretty ridiculous. Um, there we go. Look, look at our armor. It's just it's insane. This is why another reason why the synergy is so crazy if you get it early on. Because you just get so much armor from it. Oh, God. That was close. I think I blocked those bullets with the turret. I'm not sure. Either way, I'm glad. Oh. Luckily, our armor is going to save us for the majority from um, from all of the uh, jammed enemies. Right, what have we got in here? Just a few little cultist boys. Yeah, easy. Oh, God. Got a thrasher. Ah, oh, he's dead. <laughs> uh, but got, got a key here. Let's keep on going. Keep on going. Yeah, them thrasher guys are horrible. They can take your armor. Um, but we don't need to worry about them. It, it's dead now. It's dead. Let's keep on going. I like our little silver um, silver egg, egg gun. Would you like an egg in these trying times? Here we go, here we go. 
so yeah, like I, I just I just memed um, Always Sunny in Philadelphia there. If anyone else has watched that, please let me know. Like, if anyone else has watched season 13 as well, please let me know because season 13 was a bit of a bit of a um, mixed bag for most people. I really liked the majority of it. Like, even the ending was great. But like, I'd like to know what other people think. If anyone else, if anyone else here has seen it, and if you haven't, please go watch it. It's great. It's very very good indeed. It's one of my top TV shows, followed by the U.S. Office. That's also brilliant. I do like myself some American TV sometimes. I mean, I, I like myself British TV as well, obviously. I like I like Red Dwarf's, like, one of my most highest rated. Ooh, hello. You are. You are pretty spicy. Um, Red Dwarf's pretty highly rated for me. Um, but we'll take the rat key. We might as well. Uh, what else? IT Crowd is something that I love. Obviously, I've mentioned Peep Show before. It's, it's even on my channel. Like, I've, I've done videos of the Peep Show back in the day. Well, did I say back in the day? It was like, it was like less than a year ago. Um, I'll give you I'll give you one more. Um, thank you. Thank you very much, Lee. Uh, but yeah, like, if, if I swear, if, if you guys... I did lose the R, by the way. Oh, well. Um, if you guys haven't watched any British TV, especially, obviously, those of you that aren't British. I know I, know I do have, like, one or two British viewers, but the majority of you aren't British. Um, and if you're not, please go and watch some British TV. Like, it's, it's very easy to find on, on the internet, and you can find some really good shows like it crowd is something that i believe everyone will love whether no matter where you're from if you are if you are someone that likes video games and likes computers and that sort of stuff basically if you're a bit of a nerd it is like a great show <laughs> it's so relatable it's it's very very funny very good indeed oh the scrambler's out of ammo ew what is this Ugh. it gross it gross indeed i don't like it I need ammo. Give me ammo. Thank you. Thank you very much, Lee. Excuse me? Yeah, the scramble's a bit weird. It always, like, when it homes, it goes for the closest target. But say you fire an enemy, but it hasn't quite spawned in yet. It won't go for that target. It'll go for one, like, miles away and just pelt all its bullets into the wall. Very odd in that, in that way. Right, just let, let, it, let it do its thing. Let it do its thing. Let nature take six course. That that's gonna be pretty good with this. Yeah, that's 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 pretty good. I like that. I like that. I'm gonna use that for room clearing a bit. That's that's really good with this sort of synergy. Would you? Is it is a synergy, isn't it? Yeah, I'd call it a synergy. Right. Need to make sure not to hit the DPS cap a bit too much there. Right. Oh god, the turret, I got stuck on the turret. Alright. Yeah, I hit the DPS gap a bit too much at the start there. You can rapid fire it, but yeah, it will it will tend to do that. There we go. I just didn't want to lose out, uh, run out of ammo and have to uh, get hit and lose my flawless. That would not be the best idea. Got trick gun here. That's a bit weird. A bit strange, a bit peculiar. Right. To the next floor, I guess. Straight to the next floor. Um, I'll use my big iron a little bit because that's going to be quite fun. Big iron is pretty good with um, with bloody nine mil, and also it's got a small magazine and it's got. I wouldn't say it's got a long reload, but it does have a reload. <laughs> so not having a reload makes it much much better. Yeah, we're gonna be firing off bloody nine mils like a madman. Oh, that's great! I love this. In order to fire this thing off like in its entirety, just like that is great. So useful. Got our rat room straight away here, which is nice. Very nice indeed. Please go away, bullets. There we go. We're good, we're good. I found our rat door as well. Which is rather nice. Oh, a key as well. It's all coming up for us. Let's go. I love his little waddle look. His little walk is great. Right, let's go and do this. Um. Something I do have to say as well is, even without adding any extra stuff in with Mod the Gungeon, we are prone to crashes more when we're doing Mod the Gungeon. Just the game just doesn't like you modding. Like I mean, it's a given. It's not. A, it's not a mod. It's not a game that's meant to be modded. Really, it's a. It's sort of an external mod. They have said it's allowed, but they don't support it. Uh, they don't have anything built in to support modding. 
Uh, so it, do, it, is, it is sort of risky and we will get crashes every now and again. And there is going to be times where, say I do like half a run like this and then it crashes. I'm going to have to leave it because right now I've got like... I've got like 45 minutes until I need to go to work, and this run's got about 45 minutes left on it, so or maybe a little bit less. So if if it crashes, I I don't I can't do anything about that. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to leave it as is. I mean, hopefully it won't. I think if we I think if we sort of hold off on um on the modding too much, don't go too far with it. I think for the most part we'll be okay, but we just gotta prepare for that eventuality because that will happen every now and again. Oh my god, three bl three bloody nine mils is great. Yeah, it will happen every now and again. We'll sometimes get to the point where episodes are cut short by a crash, and that is a big shame. It's, it's one of the one of the big downfalls of modding, but you can expect it in any game that's not got mod support, really. Even with games like Skyrim that have mod support, it still happens a lot, so... It's just something you've got to sort of come to expect. The little bomber would be good with this, but it has a charge-up. Like, single-shot single, single uh, shot items that have a charge-up on them don't really work as well. Getting rid of the reload is nice, but it's not great. Not getting great shops, really. All in all. All in all, not the best. This get this little shed. I hate him. He always gets stuck down here. Yeah, little mongoloid. Mongoloid? Mongoloid is what I meant to say there. Oh, South Park's another show that I really like. I mean, it's it's a bit crude for some people, and it can be a bit, it'd be a bit crass, but I think it's like... It's a really important show in, in just in life. Like it, it, it touches on all the important issues, and it it makes a mockery of them in a way that in a way that makes you realise how stupid some of the issues are. Like there was an episode, like I think it was last year or year before, about like um, taking the mick out of um, food reviewers. Like is it Yelp reviewers that were called? I can't remember. It's the American one. Um, taking the make out of how Yelp reviews were and how important they made themselves feel and things like that and how they'd like ask for freebies and stuff and that, how it like just wasn't okay and people were being entitled because they reviewed food online. It's like you're not entitled. You're not. You're not anything. <laughs> and uh, it's 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 good that you do, but it doesn't make you any better than anyone else. Um, it doesn't entitle you to free food and things like that. And people were abusing it. And it was a really it was a really good way to touch on a, an important issue that was just stupid. And it made I think it shed light on just how ridiculous the issue actually was and how stupid people were being. I think I think that's I think that's important. I think Ooh. Oh yes. I think more um more shows need to do that. Um I think table take blank and this'll be a good idea. Uh, yeah, I think I think more TV shows need to sort of use, utilize that. I know that um, what's it called? Um, Always Sunny does that as well, which is another reason I like that show. That that show touches on a lot of important issues and sort of clears things up and things like that. And I really like that. It's very very good indeed. It is something that I look forward to show. Like it doesn't have to have big meaning behind it, but it does help. It does make me more interested in the show if it has like a message or a meaning. And South Park has always been like that from from season one. Like they've always had episodes that like touch on really important issues and like as well South Park's really good because I think it's like seven days <coughs> oh sorry <coughs> seven days it takes them to make an entire episode like there's a they did a they did a, like a documentary called seven days to air and it's that's insane they can make an entire TV show a 20 minute TV show based on current events in 20 uh, in seven days it's 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 actually mental oh that's 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 tickety boo that is um, also, wait a minute, doesn't this synergize with the portable turret as well? Pretty sure it does. But, um, yeah, that's, that, that's, that's, that's amazing, like, uh, there was a, there was an episode that they did the, um, like, way back when, when Obama got elected, where the, they had an episode out about the Obama election. I think it was, like, what was it? Um, I think it was, like, 24 hours or 48 hours after Armour Synthesizer, really. Um, 48 hours after the episode, the episode, uh, blah, blah, the election happened. Like that's insane. 48 hours, 20. Even if it was 24, whatever. It was either way. That's that's mental. Most TV shows take days, sometimes weeks, sometimes years to make. Like it's crazy that they did that. Absolutely mental. I mean, he's a big iron actually. Oh my god, this is not a good position to be in. If you didn't know, ow, I got hit. I knew I was in a bad spot there. I know it. Oh my god, this yeah, it does work with RNG bullets. Very nice indeed. I've already been hit, so I don't really give a damn. 
Not that I need my flawlesses exactly. This thing is mental. Absolutely fucking insane. <laughs> That's so crazy. What we got? Bundle of Wands. Another one that's pretty good, I'd say. Cast Iron, what does that do? Ooh. Ooh. Spicy. Right, to the next floor. But I think, wait, is this Rat Floor? It is Rat Floor. Don't be so stupid. Go down to your Rat Fight, fool. Um, yeah, like, I think it's just... There's too many issues in the world that don't that don't get looked at in I wouldn't say um like in a funny fashion it doesn't have to be funny it just has to be like you have to look at it from an outside view and think how how important is this actually like and like like I said with South Park the fact that it makes a mockery of it 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 often proves how how stupid it is like another episode though it's it's a great episode all in all but another episode that's really good is uh, the one where there's no internet like the internet goes off and like ar around the world and um every, it goes like black and white and everyone's like traveling traveling up to California to see if they can get some internet and it's like that's what the world would be like it honestly is like, like if you think about it. If the uh, if the internet went off worldwide, you know for a fact that everyone would be like going wherever the internet was. People need internet. It's 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 the driving force of our world now. It's like it's, I still can't believe the internet isn't like uh, um, what's it called? Oh wait, am I going the right way? Yeah, yeah. No, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Um. Ah oh, shit! I can't remember where I've been now. I'm talking too much. I think I'm up one more time, aren't I? Mm, no, am I? I can't remember. What did I do? There was the first room with the with the chance beyonds, and there was the second room. Was the second room nothing? Or was the second room the um, the the chaser dudes? I think it's. I'm gonna go up one more. I, this might be wrong. Might be wrong, but if it is, if it is, it is. It seems good so far. This is insane. I love the synergy. It got rid of our big iron synergy, our other one, but... Do you know what? I don't give a damn. This is awesome. Right, so this should be it. Let's hope, hope and pray. Nope. Nope. I did it wrong. Dagnabbit. Just one of those things, people. Just one of those things. I'm sorry. I just focused too much on talking. Um, But either way, we, we, we only missed out on a few items. What a shame. I'm a big doofus. Uh, but yeah, like... Um, yeah, like, if the internet went off, it'd just... It'd be, he like, hell. But I, I, I don't get how it isn't, like, a right yet. It, uh, access to the internet should be it should be one of your rights. It really should. In, in, in today's world... I mean, it's obviously it's not possible everywhere in the world. There are some poorer countries that just don't have it in most of the country. Like, it can't be done there, really. Unless... It, Every country wants to donate a hell of a lot of money, which they already do anyway, so it just goes on war. But we're getting we're getting pretty heavy here, aren't we? Getting pretty heavy indeed. Oh my god, this is incredible. With platinum balls, this is pretty pretty damn good. Oh shit, I got hit. Oh well. Getting hit's probably a good thing. Whoa, what's go what's going on here? All of them enemies didn't exist, so you know they were frozen. Pretty weird. Pretty weird. Let's go back to our big iron, because that's now refilled. Oh, yes. The big iron is very, very nice. We do have a, a cleansing shrine there, but we don't really need it. Be frozen, fellas. I forgot we had that. Aha! Yay! Really needed that, thanks. Bloody cleanse shrine, I don't need you. I like my curse. I ain't no puss. I can deal. I can deal with it. Go, turret. Kill him. Look at that. Turret did it. Turret's very good. Very good indeed. I just wish it had more health. I wish it was a bit better against bosses. There should just be a synergy that makes it invincible. I don't know what it'd be, but... 
There should be a synergy that makes it invincible. An extra key. An extra key for me. How how nice. How nice indeed. We've got chickens all over the place now. All over the gosh damn place. Hello. Right. These guys should go down pretty quickly. I could get hit there, but who gives a damn? Well, that guy was like crawling out the ground and just wouldn't. Where, where are you? Stop. Being so slow. Thank you. Hey, how slow them guys are. Oh my god. Difficult stuff here. Oh. Spicy. Let's go get our chest. Be up this way. Going on an adventure to get our chest. No tables in here for us to flip. Ooh, armor. We definitely need some of that. We're quite low on armor, actually. Really low, in fact. See? I'm lying for comic effect. Do you get it? <laughs> I am a comedian master. Right. This is insanely powerful. It's it's gross. I feel like I'm cheating. I mean, I am cheating. I literally am cheating, but I feel like I'm cheating. Ugh. What, what are you, chesty? Ew. Wow, the Dungeon Eagle. I'm so happy. Jesus Scramble for a bit. Haven't used a Scramble in a hot minute. I'm very sorry to all you people that wanted to see me fight the rat. I messed it up because I was talking about South Park. <laughs> and internet. Oh, that's good. I like that. I like that indeed. I like that bigly. Right, got a boss. Right, just, just take it slower. There we go. This is a bit better. If you keep it at a sort of a regular pace, then you can sort of not hit the DPS cap. There we go. Sort of kill the pillars at a certain interval so that they don't like, get to actually do any attacks. We've got two of these up at once, which is pretty awesome. Nice. That was that was that was a pretty quick kill. I do like the kill pillars. They're they're, they're my easiest boss, definitely. Oh, fat bullets is good. I like fat bullets. Oh, a shop of some kind. And flak bullets is good too. That would be pretty good without reload, maybe. Nah, let's keep, let's keep on keeping on there. Keep on keeping on. So yeah, this run is going to be cut short a teensy bit to normal, but <clears throat> that's probably good for me anyways. I swear I didn't do it on purpose. It wasn't, it wasn't something that I, I meant to do, but <clears throat> it is going to help us a little bit anyways, so. Can't complain. We have like an extra 40% damage from our chaos bullets as well, which is... Rather nice. Oh, hello. You need to die quick. Goddamn scary boy. <clears throat> Big scary boy. You might be able to hear that I have a bit of a bit of a raspy voice, bit of a have a bit of a cold going on here. Sort of the flu's going around. The lurgy. I got a bit of it, unfortunately. Not great for YouTubing, but that's life. Like I have to. I get up in the morning and do my videos. Normally I just get up and do them, but I'm having to wait like a good 20, 30 minutes before I can do my videos because they just sound like shit in the morning. Like absolute shit. I have to wait until I sound okay. <laughs> Otherwise, you just hear bleh, bleh, me coughing all the shit. I'll be doing Ethan coughs up in this bitch. Right, let's get that down. Oh, yes. Taurus a beast. Look at it. Look at it go. Killed that guy. Whoa, I got hit. Secret room there. Yeah. Our armor's almost off the screen. That's pretty insane. A gun muncher. Um, I guess we could munch some stuff. We could munch this because we're not using this at all. Um, and let's have a think. I guess the battery gun, we're not using that either. That could be two good guns. They, 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 they sort of go hand in hand. Ish. Maybe. Life orb. Ooh. I like life orb. Life orb's pretty dope. Plus one bullets is derpera. Thank you. The Rattler's pretty good too. Pinker Glonstone. Isn't that just charms enemies, the Pinker Glonstone? Um. But plus one bullets just extra damage, so. Oh my god, dude. You might as well shut up. Might as well stop being alive straight away. There we go. Look. You were never gonna live. Ever. Mimic! Fire resistance is something. I suppose. Boom. Boom. Hey, hey, hey. 
The flak bullets of this thing is actually really good. Imagine if the flak bullets were herming too. Now that would be insane. But there's just bullets everywhere. Let's try out the big iron because we haven't tried that out yet with this, with the fat bullets and the flak bullets and all that sort of jazz. That's gonna be pretty good. Just more chance to chicken. We've got life orb going on there as well with um, our RNG bullets, which is always nice. I like me some RNG bullets, so it's one of my favourite items in the game. People hate it, but me, I love it. I think it has issues, but I, I pretty much love it. I think it's pretty damn good. Pretty damn tasty. Pretty darn tasty, if I do say so myself. Oh, really? You teleporting fucker? Look at her turkey. Come on, Becky. Come on, Becky. Ooh, armor. Got him. Got him. Ah, just got just through to our chest. Ooh. See that dodge? That's gonna be pretty good, I think. Let me try this out. Mm, kind of. You have to you have to shoot again to set it up again. Mm, it's all right. It's all right. It's all right. It's okay. Where you at? Ho ho! Oh fuck! A key! That could actually be useful, sir. Might as well keep it on us. We could find an extra chest. We do have ring of chest friendship, so it's very possible. I believe we have that. Can't remember. We might not. I might be misremembering things. A stunned chicken. I'm sorry, chicken brethren. I didn't mean to stun you. It was an accident. You were caught in the crossfire. Where you at? What's going on here? I keep pressing reload. I, I need to remember that I don't need to press reload at all, ever. Not how the synergy works. Oh my god, that was insane. This is just a mad run. It just is very mad. The ration is something. It's it's healing, but I think it just gives us coolness if we use it now, so might as well. Might as well. I think it gives coolness. It might not. I might be lying. I probably am. When am I right about anything? Don't listen to me. I'm stupid. Apart from when I tell you how to play the Gungeon, because that's something that I know a bit. I'm not making any sense. I need to shut up. Another key. Goodbye, death. Or Sebastian, as, as, uh, as Lazy calls it. I'm sorry, Sebastian. <laughs> that was very mean of her. <laughs> I accidentally calls you death. Woo! What you trying to do to me? What kind of shit you trying to pull, boy? Got a boss now. I I think I'm going to do this. Hammer him. It fires really fast. It's going to fire loads of different bullets. There we go. Sometimes we take our finger off and start firing again. And it's, it goes straight away. Yeah, this is going pretty well. This is going pretty darn tootin' well. Ah, apart from when we get hit. But who gives a doubt about being hit? Just more ammo. There we go. I kind of wanted to get hit there. Got the ass blank in that. That turret's getting in there as well. It's all good, man. It's all good. I think it fires fully charged shot, fully charged mega hand shots as well, not not the weak ones, which is pretty good. I didn't think it would. I thought I'd just fire the weak ones. It does with some guns. You can see them coming off like when the when the flag bullets trigger. So it does look like fully charged shots, which is pretty pretty derp in my opinion. Didn't think that'd happen. Do you think anything better? I mean, I guess the scramble amble amble, probably one cycling. Probably. Oh shit! It's been a bit of a been a bit of a tasty day for right now. Come on now. This has got a one cycle. There, yeah, it did good. If you say that in one cycle, I'd be mighty surprised. Mighty surprised indeed. Alright, let's get down to bullet hell and wreck some shit. Nothing. Oh, wait, we could. We could buy the Rattler. I guess we'll buy the Rattler. It's something at least. Fire's faster now, so that's a plus. We'll try it out on the next floor. See if it does anything good. If not, 
Let's just switch back. I'm just thinking because it's a shotgun with RNG bullets, it's going to be pretty useful. Any sort of spread firing weapon or fast firing weapon is really good with RNG bullets. So I'm sort of thinking of that idea. Um, and the Rattler's just a fun item anyways. It poisons enemies. Uh, got a pretty good dam base damage. Decent fire rate. And no reload, so... Yeah, this is pretty good. I like this. And it hisses. It hisses, which is cool. This room sucks dick. Big dick. Right, what we got left up here? Nice. So glad that room's over. No second wave for us. Right, just, just fire it as fast as you can everywhere. Best way to do it. Fire it as fast as you can at everything. Nice. I like that. I like the way you work it. Oh, jammed enemy. I don't think so. I don't think so, enemies. Easy. Easy street. And our armor is, like, ridiculous as well, so... Don't really need to worry about that. Right, they're all dead. Cool. Ah! Uh, it still hit me. There's a secret room here. Um, I guess we can try it. <clears throat> I guess we can try it. Feed any of our shit guns that we don't want firing out of our um, thingy into it. Oh, it gave us that a two. <laughs> very nice indeed. Oh, that's very nice. That's very nice indeed. Never have to reload either. The platinum bullets will be able to fire so many saws as well. I'm liking this already. To be fair, this is going to be pretty good with um, with this thing, isn't it? We fire a saw blade around again. Maybe not. Maybe not. Um, this. I fire for one saw blade. I'd rather just use this. Get all the saw blades I can. All the saw blades I can. Oh, the DPS is insane. I love this gun so much. Probably one of my favourites. Hey, that was cheeky. Like the real thing. Yeah, it's pretty insane too. Pretty insane. Oh shit, my dude. Cool, we're good. We Gucci. It doesn't fit through the gap. Oh shit, oh shit. That was a bit, that was a bit, a bit toasty for me, that was. Just a bit toasty. Oh, I can't believe this is ace here. It feels like an S tier. The fact that it gives you a heart as well is just... Makes it. If it wasn't with it, if it was without the heart and without the speed upgrade, I'd totally say it's A tier. But like with everything else, like it's just mad. Like it's such a good gun, like for the price you're paying for it, which is usually nothing. I've never, I don't think I've ever seen this thing in a shop. That would be mad. I'd definitely buy it. Just let that deal with them. Ah, CBA dealing. Oh god damn it. Where's that full heart? Put that in the box. Not that we'll ever need it, but just in case. Just in case. Oh my god. There we go. That's 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 made things a bit easier. Hey. That's pretty good. It's a good ashore. Right. That's that done. Ooh, I love it. I want some more of it. Don't think so, shot group. That's a gear tactic right there. Don't think so, man. You trying to you trying to beef on me? Whoa there. Whoa there, donkey. Calm down. Oh there, oh there, oh there. Oh there. Another terrible room.
Alright, let me, let's deal with it. Probably shouldn't have wasted that, but... Who gives a diggity darn? Certainly not me. Most certainly not me. Another room made easy by not having to reload ever. This room was brought to you by fucking OP as shit. Yeah, let's just get these guys all stunned up. Yes, stunned and frozen. Oh, back to full ammo. Hey, 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 it's the boss guy. It's the boss man. The boss man can. Ah, well. We got hit. What a big shame. And again. Oh, well. We get extra damage if we get hit as well because we're playing the convicts. I kind of forgot about that. But it's something to think about. Nice. Now for this next phase, let's scramble amble him. Whoa, Black Betty, scramble him. Get his hand. Take me. Take me to your leader. Nice. Yeah, that, that got destroyed pretty quick. Ow. He keeps hitting me, but that doesn't matter to me. Ah, well. Who gives a damn? I don't know why that attack's even there. This one's difficult. Well, that, that one with his, with the, um, where he just fires out the shots and they're coming from the side. It's so easy for the Lich. Like, you, you really wouldn't think the Lich would have an attack that easy. What the hell's going on here? Okay, that, that was that was strange. Right. Um, this thing. Right, put that there. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that thing's on it. Don't think so, mate. Don't think so, mate. Don't think so, mate. I don't think so, mate. And that was one of the easiest wins of our entire life. <clears throat> Very nice. Very nice indeed. We could fall down as a skeleton, because apparently if you're not the actual character, you have to be a skeleton. Strange, I don't know why they do that, I just have to karma and, and like Dallas and all that sort of stuff there. It's weird, but that was <laughs> a pretty mega run. I'm very, very, oh god. I'm very, very thankful we didn't crash, that's very nice indeed. Um, but we've got a nice little win going on for us there. Uh, it's going to be a pretty good, um, a pretty good little run there for us. Just under, yeah, just under 45 minutes. Pretty nice. Uh, next time, I think I'm going to do something suggested by you guys. Uh, so make sure to leave all your suggestions in the Discord. I've already got a few, but uh, the more the merrier. The more the better. Um, anyone that isn't in the Discord already, please make sure you join um, if you can. It is a nice place to chill out with other subscribers and talk to me and um, give me suggestions for my series. And also, I'll be recording my first episode of the Binary of Isaac series rather soon. So that'll be coming within the week, I'd assume. Uh, like, maximum a week from now. Um, so, I'd say within the week. So, hopefully we'll be seeing that soon. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next one.